people do and what services or products do you offer? Honeywell is a multinational conglomerate. We're a Fortune 100 company with over 110,000 employees worldwide and existing in over 900 sites globally. Now, Honeywell works across industries. Uh, we provide industry-specific solutions. In aerospace, we provide products and services, for example, aviation systems, auxiliary power units. In building technologies, we're providing controls, safety and security solutions. In performance and material technologies, we're providing control systems for uh, refineries and plants. We also have high quality uh, performance materials and chemicals. Uh, in safety and productivity solutions, we provide uh, mobility solutions for employees, safety solutions as well for employees and safety products. But if you look at it from a bird's eye, what we are doing is actually leading through innovation in changing the way the world works and solving some of the toughest challenges that our customers are facing. Uh, to name a few, energy efficiency, productivity, and uh, you know, also uh, worker safety. Why did you establish yourself in Kuwait? We've been in Kuwait for over 50 years now, uh, supporting uh, key industries here in uh, transforming uh, over the past years, um, particularly the oil and gas and uh, the construction business uh, like airports, healthcare, uh, education. Uh, also the aviation industry. These are the main sectors we work in. What makes Honeywell stand out from the other companies within the same industry? Well, you know, we've talked about our mission of changing the way the world works. Uh, we're now taking charge as industries go through the digitalization and the digital transformation. Are we providing uh, services, uh, software, and, and the digital solutions that set the pace for the ever-changing and fast-changing world around us. I think that's a critical aspect of what is really differentiating Honeywell at the current stage. This is our strategy moving forward, and uh, that's what we're uh, set to do. What is your company's most recent accomplishment? Well, you know, accomplishments are many globally and internationally, but I think I wanted to focus a little bit more on what Honeywell has been doing in Kuwait here. Uh, over the past two years, we've been focusing on three main things. First of all, driving digitalization with our customers and partners, uh, leveraging on IoT and big data. Uh, second is uh, about cybersecurity in particular. We wanted to make sure that the critical infrastructures here in, in Kuwait uh, are safe and secure. And third is about uh, growing local talent and knowledge, so through uh, expertise exchange and through training programs. So that's what we've been focusing on over the past two years. Uh, if we're talking about accomplishments in that regard, I'm very proud that last year we've been uh, selected as uh, Energy Company of the Year in Kuwait by Arabian Business. This is a result of some of the key strategic initiatives that we've executed. Today we're here, uh, I'm talking to you from our customer experience center. This is a platform where we actually collaborate and we uh, train and uh, show and demonstrate to our customers leading technologies uh, and uh, how they can service and optimize their operations. We've also uh, had an automation college we established two, three years ago. The Automation College provides trainings to our customers, technicians, and engineers. Uh, we have also established a partnership with KFAS Academy to provide a virtual training courses in the industrial automation space. Uh, most importantly, however, we've also inaugurated earlier the, uh, last year uh, a customer solution center. A customer solution center provides made in Kuwait solutions to what power the oil and gas industry digital transformation. What is the biggest challenge you face in your industry? Well, as I said, the industry is facing two main challenges as they go through the digital transformation. First of all, it's uh, security, and particularly cybersecurity. 
you know, as, uh, as, you, as you start utilizing data more and more, as things become more connected, the risk of cyber attacks increase. And this is a trend that we've been seeing over the past uh, few years. Honeywell, with its expertise in uh, automations and controls, is very well positioned to actually tackle these challenges. And we've been working extensively with our partners and our customers in addressing these uh, risk aspects through uh, our new latest solutions. Um, the second one is actually how you can utilize digitalization to, uh, to improve your performance, your business performance as a whole. And this requires a holistic approach, an approach that looks at uh, your people, your assets, and your processes, and extract the maximum value out of these with the greatest impact on your uh, performance as an entity or as an organization. Over the past year, uh, Honeywell has been taking charge in that with our Forge uh, solution, Honeywell Forge. Uh, Honeywell Forge is an enterprise uh, performance management solution that's holistic in its approach, that's software and the hardware agnostic. And we're very proud of what we're doing in that regard. And we've seen a great impact on the, our customers' performance. What should our ABC members utilize your services and do business with you? I think, you know, the fact that in Kuwait, in particular, we've been here for over 50 years. We're present directly. We have a capable workforce, engineers, and technicians on the ground ready to support our customers pre-sales and post-sales. Uh, what's more important, however, is, uh, and it's, that's our, actually our greatest assets, is our people. You know, we uh, are future shapers. You know, we believe that the future is what you make it. Uh, people is our ultimate differentiator. Uh, we take great pride in what they do. They are uh, dreamers. Uh, they are actually what makes the difference and they are able to execute and as such you know i think with uh, honeywell besides our customers and partners they have a strong and solid uh, way to execute and deliver on what they their strategic objectives i think you know maybe something that's also important as we all operate in kuwait we all know that uh, you know kuwait uh, 2035 vision has been initiated a couple of years ago. And uh, part of it is, of course, you know, growing a knowledge economy, improving collaboration among businesses within Kuwait, whether it's SMEs or international, uh, international businesses. And that's why we are also part of ABCK at the board, where we try to actually drive these initiatives forward.